I, I journal. So I journal all the time. And so I could actually go to the day and time that I was feeling certain ways. And you could read through the writing that I have of like what I went through and when my heart started changing. And I said a prayer and I said, God, like I truly feel like I'm not in the place that I should be. So even if it breaks me or hurts me, take my feet and plant them where they need to be. And through that very wild storm, I wouldn't change a second of it. And let me tell you, Howie, I'm not trying to be dramatic. Bro, there was times I passed out, fell down the stairs because of just, I was so scared. Imagine, what, was your, what was your biggest fear? Like, what would you be scared of? My biggest fear is that I worked this hard to leave and people made me out to be a man I'm not. And that I had to exit being a man I wasn't proud of because of editing or certain ways they try to paint me. And so I thought if I left that I'd be hated. And there have been so many YouTube people, like big YouTubers that made videos taking out even them. Not only did my team do that for me, but like these guys would only highlight what I did wrong. And it broke me. But go read the comments. You can't hide the truth. Even their audience were like, absolutely not. And it, like, for example, there was a guy named Sonny V2. He made a video about me like literally three days ago. It has like three million views. Why I ruined the biggest show. 99% of the comments were like, you got this wrong. This was, and they're explaining it in paragraphs. So I moved and the people moved with me. And on Impulsive, we discussed, Mike, Logan, and me. They said, I asked a question. I go, would you rather have the belt and the whole world think you lost or lose and have the whole world know you win? And they said they would rather have the belt. And I said, I'd rather have the world. And that's how it worked. Were what? you scared to walk away because of what you thought others would think of you, how they would perceive you? Are you that con are you concerned about the perception of who you are? I am because I hold a responsibility of setting an example of a man I am. And I try to portray that so men could be a good, good human being while working hard and accomplishing things that they probably couldn't unless they cheated or they did something wrong. And so while I took this long road by... I bring my manager in here. He's brought me million dollar offers for gambling. And I said, I want to fucking do it for a billion dollars. And I've turned down way more money and nobody will ever know the decisions that I made behind closed doors. And then they started editing and started doing things. And it, and, and it just, I don't care about money. I don't care about fame to a certain extent. I care about being the best human being that I could possibly be and achieving the highest level that I can. So if you're going to steal something from me, take my money, take, take my pride, take my ego, but don't, don't take away what I took and my parents took to build who I am because there is a young version of me that's following in my footsteps. And what happens if he sees a light that I wasn't portrayed to be in and now he walks away from a foundation that I very much believe in? I guess the big question is, um, is there any way your manager can get me those gambling uh <laughs> I, I'm getting you a Celsius. <laughs> I already made a Celsius call. Yeah, but you just said it's a million dollar gambling brand. If he's listening, I'm I'm available. Davidge, are you even listening? Uh, I don't give a shit. Okay, but it, it, what? So what is the biggest? On a, on a serious note, what is the biggest um, misconception of you and what happened there that y you uh, that bothered you? And it's not true. And maybe they got that misconception because of the way you were editorialized or. I'm really not, they, they very much made it clear that I'm not allowed to speak up about things. So I, I can't even. Legally? Yeah. Uh, did we, we did, was this a, I didn't know that you guys were in a legal. Well, he likes to tend to argue with me. And so he argues with me on the podcast and, and, and about things. And uh, I think he, I, I said, okay, then how about we discuss this? What you've guys done? Let's talk about this. And he goes, yeah, do it. And then I go, okay. And so I tweeted out, uh, I wasn't going to talk out of respect, out of respect for the man. So, I, and then his attorneys hit me up and said, Hey, let me remind you about the stuff you've signed. And I said, okay. So not that, and I don't know if, the, if this could be, I, I want to be respectful of everybody. Yeah. You know, and, uh, Logan, um, you know, he does his podcast here when he's here and uh, I don't know him that well and he works with uh, Proto and things like that. And I said, I just said, because I didn't want to cross a line and I don't want to cross a line with you. Yeah. But uh, so I- uh, You I, asked him if I could you could have me on. He'd probably say, yeah, because he knows I, I wouldn't. I would not ask if he can have you on. I can have anybody on. 
But what I said to him, because I'll show you what I said to him, because I'm going to I'm going to share this with you. Yeah. Do you know how to get to your messages? No, show me. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm, I'm watching share, him struggle me, right now. Get me to get me to my messages. Yeah. Here's what I said to him. I said, I'm having George on, yeah. you know, and if there's some place that you don't want me to tread because either of you would get in trouble, uh, you know, legally or whatever. And he answered, I'm just look, trying to look for his thing. He said, I can talk about anything. Yeah. I mean, Knowing that you can't. Yeah, right? exactly. Oh, okay. And also it's like, I, I don't know. I don't want to do that. That's not how my parents raised me to be. I, I don't need okay, to. Okay. He go. just said, I can talk about anything. I, that, that's all he said. I could talk, you could talk about anything. I said, I don't want to step on if this is legal, if this is, and I don't want to, I don't want to offend you, yeah. but you're here to defend your, you, you don't have to defend yourself. I'm a fan and of everything you do. And I'm a fan of Logan's. I, you know, I did the podcast and I had a great time on it. He hasn't come on mine, but, <laughs> and, and you have. <laughs>